tired for dinner live. I said, I am All right, thank you. All right, so we have a Norge. You got that camera? Okay. Fucking thing, I'll tell you. God damn! I is it the camera or is it the operator? It's my prostate. I, okay. <laughs> so, anyways, we have a very special guest for you tonight. He's a professional comedian. Everyone, put your hands together for Steve Farrell. <laughs> very well. How are you doing? I'm a little nervous about the uh, number one fan. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell is the number one fan? Work. He's at work. He's uh, probably cleaning he's his He's got a one. job. At least he's got a job. <laughs> <laughs> Are you in a relationship? Uh, no, I am single. I've been uh, single for a while. And uh, actually, I think I've discovered my problem with women. I've discovered I don't know how to read women. I think they want one thing and then they end up wanting something completely different. Like, women always say they want a guy with a sense of humor. But even though I'm a stand-up comedian, I know I'll never be as funny as a rich guy. He's <laughs> 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 funny, apparently. <laughs> so, you're a stand-up comedian. You, do you go on tour? I do. I get out on the road a lot. Um, you know, I have a bad habit when I'm on the road. I tend to eat at a lot of Denny's. <laughs> and uh, I'm not proud of it, but... You know, I like Denny's um, because they put the pictures of the food on the menu. <laughs> In case you thought Moons Over My Hammy was too good to be true. <laughs> it's there in all its glory. I think they put the pictures on the menu because the people who stumble in at 3 in the morning, at three in the morning are too hammered to read the menu. <laughs> they should just make it a pop-up book. <laughs> that way all the drunk people think they've already ordered. <laughs> So do you, do you, is it just Denny's, or do you ever make it to like any nice restaurants, or? I do. I actually went to a, a nice restaurant last week, and uh, they had a bathroom attendant in the bathroom. And uh, I hate bathroom. You know what I'm talking about? They take the uh, yeah. toiletries, they put them on the counter and expect you to tip them. How about leaving us alone in the bathroom? <laughs> <laughs> it's a private place. People are doing embarrassing things. That's the last place we need a salesman, you know. <laughs> you know it's like having someone... Standing in your bedroom while you're having sex, going, all right, me too, we're done, we have cigarettes here for you. <laughs> <laughs> so, when you're, when you're on a uh, tour, I was, I was talking to you on your cell phone, and there was some, something going on with your <clears throat> cell phone. What, what's up with your, your service? It's bad. That's what's up with um, I'm just, I'm tired of the cell phone companies. I just can't deal with it anymore. I'm tired of being manipulated. Because um, I just throw around time like it means nothing. I mean, I have 5,000 night and weekend minutes. Are there even 5,000 minutes in all the nights and weekends? <laughs> They're just inventing time. You know? It's like they know we're not going to use the time. That's the thing. My off-peak hours are from 9 p.m. to 6 a.m. <laughs> hey, thanks for the crystal meth calling plan. <laughs> Close that door for me. I just hear that car leaving, and I'm, I, and I'm screwing up your. Uh, <laughs> I've been screwed up by worse than a car, though. Okay. okay. Crystal Mountain. So now, if you, if you, if you, are you one of those comedians that? Um, are you a morning person, or do, are you one of those comedians that sleeps in until like four in the afternoon? No, I get up early, but I'm a slave to the snooze button. I'm just I'm so dependent on it. But I'm a little annoyed at the increments of time this news cycle comes in. It's like seven minutes, nine minutes. You know, it's bad enough you have to get up early for work, now you have to do math at dawn. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's like that's a perfect word problem for kids in schools today. Like Bobby needs to be up by six thirty AM. <laughs> he sets his alarm for five fifty four AM. Assuming a seven-minute snooze cycle, <laughs> how lazy can Bobby be? <laughs> so, well, we, we were just... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, that's the end of that bit, dude. Leslie, <laughs> <laughs> you. Leslie you know, you got, do you have any questions? Well, I was, I was just wondering a little bit about yourself. 
uh, tell us about yourself. Are you are you a bad boy? Do you have any uh, tattoos, perhaps? Um, no. <laughs> do not have any tattoos. I, I actually, I thought about getting a tattoo, but I can't think of, it's just forever, you know? I can't think of anything profound enough to say that will agree with forever. <laughs> it's like, I know if I get something, like if I get a tattoo, I know I'm going to wake up when I'm 80 and look down and be like, PlayStation 2. <laughs> I mean, if you get something you agree with, like, you know, when, if you think you're going to agree with it when you're 80, it's awkward now. And then, like, if you got off your shirt with some girl and she's like, what, is, what do you have a tattoo that says Medicare? You're single, but are you, are you looking for a relationship? Are you, are you ever going to get married? Mm, probably. I guess. I'm in no hurry. Uh, I am looking forward to the wedding registry, though. Um, I am. I'm looking forward to the wedding registry. I, you know, some friends of mine got married and recently, and I had to buy a gift off the wedding registry. But you know what? Don't thank me for getting a gift off the wedding registry. Because what are you thanking me for? I didn't pick anything out. All I did was go by and pick it up. That's not buying a gift. That's running an errand. <laughs> and that's what I'm going to do for my wedding. People are like, hey, Steve, congratulations. Where are you registered? Like, yeah, I just pick up my dry cleaning. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think married people need gifts. They're pulling their incomes. They're going to be fine. <laughs> Your divorce registry. <laughs> okay, Frank, were you registered? Sorry about the breakup. <laughs> Ralph's. <laughs> Needs two bottles of ketchup has zero. <laughs> Uh, speaking of being single, do you watch a lot of TV? <laughs> Good segue. <clears throat> yeah, I do. I watch a lot of TV. Actually, uh, there's a, I almost love to hate TV. It's kind of weird. I, I, like, I hate the local news. I can't stand the local news. Like, it's the weather reporters. They just drive me crazy. Because they name themselves after weather terms and geological terms. You know, Dallas Rains? Come on. Johnny Mountain? <laughs> You're still wrong. I mean, that's the thing. It's no other industry does this. That's the thing. It's like if you went in for a brain operation, they wouldn't go, "Hey, this is your surgeon, Doctor Noggin." <laughs> <laughs> well, give it up for Steve. Perry. Yeah. Yeah. Farrell, but we have to take another quick break. There's a box next to me. It says click here. There's a blue link. Click that link. Give her, give up her wet dream. We'll be right back. <laughs> Can we ask you a couple questions on camera? Sure. Okay, just come on up there. Okay, okay, quiet. Here Ready we go. To rock? Yeah. Okay. Uh, first of all, what's your name? Craig. Craig, what took you so long to get to the show? <laughs> they had PCH closed down. Well, no, I meant like, why haven't you been here before? I just moved here. Oh, where are you from? Northern California. What part? Merced. Cool. At least you didn't say Bay Area. No. I hate those people. Do that. <laughs> or say it, huh? Yeah. What brings you down to beautiful Orange County? Rehab. <laughs> <laughs> It's been five years, almost seven months for me. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. Well, did you like? 
How was Jaquita Benet? It was pretty hot. She was awesome. Oh, Brilliant, too, yeah. huh? Mm -hmm. Really smart, yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, one day at a time, keep it going. Thanks for being here. All right, thank you. All right. <laughs>